Our next speaker is a remarkable designer, winner of numerous international uh, design awards from aerospace to the next generation electric vehicles. He currently devotes a lot of his time in the study of medical and healthcare, where he's working on a number of medical devices development projects. He has kindly accepted to do his presentation today in English. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Professor Kunimoto, head of Medical Design Research Center, Nagoya City University Hospital. Thank you. Uh, today is uh, three main the project and the future uh, for the, the human being and for the DASO systems. <laughs> yeah. When? Okay, start. Oh, self. <laughs> Always. Every switch on my stuff every day, but today is self. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, the, when the sage point it the moon, the full yes uh, look at the finger, finger. This is a Chinese old saying, and it meaning the most important uh, things is thinking about the vision. However, people tend to think only about the process. Each time I thinking about the role of designer, I remind myself this story. In Zen philosophy, this circle represents one integrated world. I see it as the vision. The vision, if we can provide the scenario, the vision becomes the clear goal. To do that, we need to fantasize and imagine. First example is the ringoscope. Oh, Sorry. Just a moment, just a moment. <laughs> Fast to use this device. <laughs> 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 Sorry. Uh, okay. 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 Yeah. Uh, for, give us form the conception which is visible. We're given a form, the conception, which is not the visible. We create things we have never seen before. Very important. These are some of my achievement. My main work is now medical design. For the medical device de uh, development, we need to understand the human body. However, today's medical practice, such as bone, blood vessel, and brain. But the human body is one integrated cute creature. I believe that understanding it is the key of creation. To reach this point, I am trying to use the cloud computing in the following way. The phase one, the sharing the product data, the through cloud, 
between designer and uh, maker. Phase two, inviting medical worker and combine these, their nodes. Phase three, expanding the circle of sharing to the people from different fields, different field, so we can integrate it with them or people by changing idea. What I don't today is between phase two and phase three. The first example, advanced learning scope. This medical device has not been redesigned for such a long time, over the 100 years, even though using it is really painful to both doctor and patient. The pain is caused by the lack of understanding of human body when you take a deep look at the human body, such as the hand, they have such a graceful form and a graceful motion. Yes, human, human hand. With the focusing on that, we redesigned this device. Evaluation with doctor in each process is what we cannot miss. With a new learning scope, doctor can use it with less power and the patient will no longer lose their teeth through the procedure. <coughs> to realize this design, we use CATIA and its cloud environment, where we share the data with doctor, engineer, and maker. Thanks to all team members, this product won many international awards in China, Australia, South Korea, United States, Germany, many, many. I love Katia stuff. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. The next example is nebulizer, drug delivery system. Today, due to inefficient drug delivery system, we often need to take uh, 10 times more drugs than needed. The straight is a typical example. As we all know, excessive intake causes many side effects. This is what we did. First, we had to build the complete 3D model of less filatory system from CT scan data because it did not exist. Then we analyzed the actual flow of drug with CFD. We finally found the optimal flow for drug delivery. 
it reduces the amount of drug. Yeah. That you take to minimum and it also became possible to take insulin with this delivery system. We designed nebulizer that realized the flow using Catia Cloud, natural sketch use this design. With a 4K tablet PC, the Panasonic, our team, a joint the development, the 4K 21 inch, includes the CATIA system, this piece power out. Can see product data and exchange this opinion in each process of development. It is also possible to have the visual image like this, for the better understanding and sharing the data and the idea with everyone, without providing a real prototype, as you can see, the development process is beyond the conventional method, and each team member can advance the development at the same time. This is the power of cloud. We also use this method for pre-operative simulation. Using 3D printing technology with soft material, we make the 3D organ model, not only for the visualization. but also for simulation with the surgical robot. I designed it, the Da Vinci is the manipulator, is my design, yeah. We also designed the operative plan with doctor. In this surgery, we succeed to reduce operation time from 20 hours to only two hours. Yeah, yeah. The, the patient could leave the hospital on the next day. The patient stay only one day in hospital. Thanks to the minimal invasive, this will improve the success rate of surgery and we can save more people. Today, many different tools and formats are used for making a model. Yet, the model is far from the real owner. Now imagine your own body. Our owner is soft and alive. It can easily change in shape due to the gravity. This will be ideal. If we can integrate hard, soft biomaterial to create what we need 
our next challenge is to integrate them with time axis. Model design used to the about the designing the both relationship device and doctor and device and patient. Now we are entering the next phase. Phase four. The next phase will incorporate integrated intelligence and time axis. The integrated intelligence here means many variety of information, such as environment, advanced material, and molecular science. The time axis here means human body never stop changing. Everything is changing, especially infant change drastically. The condition of disease also change as they grow. We will need the next generation of cloud computing where elements that consist human body and product function and material that we create will be integrated. The cloud system will interact with our brain, be integrated with our vision, our icon, our intelligence, and idea. This is what I imagine for the future of cloud computing. Call, I call it Shangri-La. Yeah, thank you, thank you. And, uh, and today is a special service. This is a body as a connected system. But the new, today I have a new. Yeah, this is a biomaterial newborn system. This is the future by the that's all. <laughs> thank you thank you a big thank round you. of applause bravo <laughs> well done thank, thank you, you professor Kong thank too. You. it's a great job yeah, yeah yeah i think we can give him a real big round of applause here come on